guys, my name is Jim Hussein and today we're going to make chow mein noodles but a tiny bit of the Indian spice, like a little bit spicy yeah. So um, you will need garlic, pepper, red pepper, a mix of vegetable you can bring from Slinsbury, Tesco's or any place and chilies, onions and coriander, prawns, which people call shrimp, vegetable oil or any oil, chat masala for Indian spice, chili powder, some salt, some dark soy sauce for like dark taste and cocoa sauce for some, you know, that rich taste. So we're gonna start with pitting the um, on fire on and I'll put some oil inside so you will need about that much oil for chow mein You can add a little bit more if you want to. So um, let it, um, you know, boil your own, you know, crackling that stuff. And um, first you put some garlic. Um, after this, and then you put um, some onion. Then you add some salt, and you mix, mix, mix. And the thing, and then you add some vegetables. So when the garlic turns like brownish, add some spice, Indian spice here. Yeah. You add a little bit of chili powder. You can add, um, so us Bengalis, we like lots of chili stir right there. So after the onion is boiled, put some vegetables on. Okay, if it gets like um, to like exploding that stuff, put a low heat down. Okay, now um, this is the time to put some shrimp or prawns, if you want to call it. Here's some spin, spin, spin. Now it's time to um, put some noodles in it. So, tasty.
few kids, so ask your parents to cut this. It's really, really dangerous by cutting um, the chili for the knife. It's really like sharp knife. So um, the lucky thing is how to cut. You this you have to put and do a knife like that. Cut and that that will create a nice sense of. Now I'm cutting some coriander and I'm going to add it with the chilies. So now I'm going to put some dark soy sauce and this makes it like dark. I can't explain it but dark tastes dark. If you don't get it, you have to try the soy sauce. So you have to put like um, lots of lots of amounts. So yeah. So put that much in and mix it for a while. Add some more. Adding some more dark soy sauce. So, like us Bengalis, we like to have lots of, you know, jal masalas, like hot masalas and that stuff. So, famous one is chop masala. So, you want to add a little bit. Just for that tingly um, taste. And you want to add my favourite pear pear sauce. Tiny bit, tiny bit. <laughs> then you do mix, mix, mix. And after a while, when you mix, add some chili and coriander to when the cut is good. And some coriander. Oh, so, 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 So this is a secret when I like stay at home and something I make noodles, egg in the morning, I make rice, curry, lamb and lots of stuff. So I'm going to make it in front of you um, in some other videos so please watch our videos. So basically, yeah, this is ready and to be served. And uh, I'm gonna serve it to my my mum, my sister, and my father. And let's serve. Try it. Mmm. And it has a really, really, really good texture. And I wish you um, were here and tried it. So please make this at home, it's delicious. It should taste perfect. So, so now, so now I'm going to serve it to my parents. I'm 
we do some decoration? So that is it, how to make chow mein spicy, yeah, deshi noodles. So I hope you put in tutorial and peace. So please like and share this video and this dish is for all of the families and mums and can you see Thank you to John, the cameraman in the back, and please subscribe our YouTube channel, and you can find us on on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and other social networks. So, bye, peace, and visit our page called www.gbdtwenty4.com. Bye, and. And I'm gonna get the